Victory Death Starfighters, my name is Carlin Jones, and this is a Starfighter full episode review. And today we are going to watch the sci-fi TV show from 1994, Mantis. Now, I do not know anything about this show. I actually discovered it from like a uh, kind of like a, a twin version of like a Miss Mojo YouTube channel. And the, 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 the video that I saw it on was top 10 sci-fis you should give a chance. And this, out of all the 10 sci-fis that they showed, some of them I knew who they were, but out of all the 10 of them, this one caught my interest. And I love sci-fi. Sci-fi is probably like my second favorite genre behind like romantic comedies. But I wanted to give this show a chance, not only because it has like science stuff and like alien technology and and superheroes and stuff like that of that nature but the thing that really caught my eye was that the main protagonist the hero the superhero is a is a is a black man and for me personally i didn't know even like now i didn't know that existed in the 90s i didn't know there were black heroes on on television like live action black heroes um, obviously, you know, one of my favorite heroes and movies is Blade. Love Blade. Um, but yeah, but like besides Blade, who else was there? And you know, there was that Shaquille O'Neal movie too that I grew up watching called Steel. Um, which I, I know not a lot of people like that, but, <laughs> um, but yeah, I, I think for me personally, I think representation is so crucial and so important. And, um, the fact that this guy's a black hero, then, I'm already gonna watch it because I, I think in that that in itself is pretty freaking cool and I'm gonna really be interested to see what's his story and how he became to be who he is and hopefully it's not too stupid uh, but yeah that's what that's what piqued my interest the fact that he's a black hero um, yeah so the show Mantis once again I don't know anything about this show um, I do know that um, I think I saw a little bit of the credits beforehand, and um, Sam Raimi had a big chunk. He had his hand, his hands in the show. And Sam Raimi, for those of you who don't know, director of Evil Dead, Evil Dead Two, and director of one of my favorite superhero films of all time, Spider Man Two. Um, so that's pretty cool. And you know, Sam Raimi's always so creative with his with his works and his visuals so we'll see what happens um i think he's just a writer on it though executive producer and writer but um yeah we'll see we'll see what it's uh we'll see what it's about um so yeah let's just get right into it no expectations no no anything so you can watch this uh episode along with me on the in the description below i left a link it's on youtube so it's not like, you know, like the, be it is the beginning, beginning, but it's like, I don't know, you'll see. The, it's a pilot episode, and it's a hour and 25 minutes. So it's basically like a mini series at this point. So we're in for a long one, super long one. So let's get into it, okay? And uh, we're going to start this video in five, four, Three, two, one. Stuff's crazy. What? 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 Oh God. That's not how it works, right? <laughs> well. You know, you blow up like a little power generator thing on the side of the street. I'm sure maybe like a neighborhood's going to be affected by it, but like, I don't know about an entire block. You know what I mean? But whatever. It's the 90s. What happened?
Whoa, that thing looks creepy. That was kind of scary. I got that thing looked creepy. It does look like a mantis. Mantis are scary. If you like really look at them, they're kind of creepy. If there's like a giant one, like a human sized one, oh my god, that's scary. Oh, these police officers would have lit his ass up. All they would have to see is that gun pointed at them. And go, brrr, ba, 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 ba. How is this possible? Well, I guess it's not. I know it's going to be like alien technology, so. Got to be in a state of paralysis or something. It's like a calling card. That's whack. <laughs> calling cards are kind of whack. You see, heroes nowadays, they kind of got away from that. Granted, I know Spider-Man does it every now and again, but at least his is kind of creative. Kind of, um... I don't know, it keeps him humble. But even then, he doesn't do it often. Because he knows it's like corny deep down. <clears throat> That's a little interesting opening. I'm starting to wonder if this superhero Mantis guy is going to only be fighting crime at night. Co-producer David Ick. Ick, I pronounced that. Sam Raimi. Story by Sam Raimi. It was Sam Raimi and some other guy. I don't want to discredit the other guy. They're all gonna get blame if this if this pilot isn't good. What? You want to repeat that? <laughs> I wasn't really racist, but yeah, you can play that card. Yeah, he just said silver eyes don't matter in <laughs> the previous line. <laughs> yeah, that sounds fucking stupid. You sound like the mayor from Philadelphia. Remember all those years ago? He actually had like a tank patrolling the city. Oh, that's what's her name. Where is she from? That's it. She is from Desperate Housewives. I don't remember the actress's name. You know what? I've actually really, really love the script for Desperate Housewives from the TV show. 
I love reading reading scripts from shows, and um, Desperate Housewife is actually really smart and really funny. Uh, the scripts that is, I watched the show, and the show is like not even what the script is. Okay, I know him from Mighty Ducks. But yeah, she's from um, Desperate Housewives. She's the only character I like on Desperate Housewives. Yeah, good luck trying to get him money. Hmm. But everybody's in this. This guy's in Rush Hour. He's been in a lot of other stuff, too. Very distinctive voice. I surely know these actors' as actors' names, actors and actresses. They'll make me sound smart. She looks familiar, too. I know that actress. Oh, where is she from? It's going to come to me. What an interesting job. Working at a morgue. That's, that's scary. It's going to come to me where she's from. I don't want to IMDB it. Uh. <laughs> Another dead homeboy. <laughs> yeah, you pig. Oh, I will. Oh, here it goes. This is entitled shit. Where is she from? She's not. No, there's no way that's her. Wait, is it? No. Is that? Okay, I'm going to look it up. She was someone's mom. Damn it. All right, I'm looking it up. That's true. One of the leading uh, factors of uh, black people dying. What did Huey Freeman say? One of the leading causes of black people is uh, uh, a nigga moment, pork chops, and FEMA. Those are the three leading factors that would kill people or kill black people.
Okay, I'm gonna find her. Okay, where is she? Whoa, what? Wait, did I miss something? Oh, I'm looking at my phone. I'm trying to find this. I think I don't even have the right actress. Dude, hi on something. Wait, what's her name? Amy. She's not even listed as a top cast. Why can't I find her? This is weird. Is she not credited? I'm not seeing an Amy on IMDb. Okay, I'm just going to put this down. Oh, I don't even know. That's so weird. It's going to destroy me. I know she's from somewhere, and I probably own the movie. What the hell is going on? What the hell are these punks doing? What? How about someone be the hero and just drive in front of their car? Whoa. Whoa. Does that... <laughs> did that lady not see... <laughs> you gonna end up killing someone because they can't stop. There has to be better ways for him to do that. He's like just hanging. <laughs> This is in New York, right? Someone had to see him, though. His It was a regular car, and it turned into this type of ship.
That's weird. Oh yeah, good luck. Good luck trying to get through there. I'm liking this music. Interesting. Hmm. Interesting. You know, you can kind of see, like, it's like a blend of, like, you know, for all ages. Hey, it's Sam Raimi. You're a special unit. Not with that fucking helmet, huh? Oh, man, this is going to drive me crazy. Okay, I got to look her up. I know she's somewhere. <laughs> That was kind of funny.
This is so weird. She's not even credited on the show. Not even on the pilot. So I don't know who this is. I forgot. All right, brother, speak up. I need to stretch. This is a long episode. That dude, Hayden. <laughs> no, hold up, though. Is she willing to do that, though? She willing to try and make you jealous. I think she likes you. Definitely interesting. What you get mad for, man? Huh. You're a famous actor, too. Oh, snap. You know what? He's an Aquaman. He's been in a lot of so many other stuff, but the thing I can think of most recently is Aquaman. He was like the dad that died in the beginning.
Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> I don't I don't see how she's making the connection to the mantis with that. The mantis didn't do any fucking acrobat. So that nigga was just excuse my language. That dude was just hanging <laughs> from a ship. He was just hanging. Way to set me up for the alley-oop, homie. No, what, why the hell did you say something? Man, get out of my face. Yeah, whatever. Why would you say that? Oh my god. <laughs> Nothing worse than what we've seen from Marvel. Wow, and broad fucking day. They answer it. Yeah, why are you hating on him so much? 
At least he giving back. Get giving back to the youth and to the city. See if I can move my mic closer. Who the hell didn't want to be Michael Jordan? Or Michael Jackson. I was just telling a friend today about like we were talking we we're talking about what keeps us motivated and making content and I was like, oh, there's like a really good YouTube channel about like top ten successes, top ten rules for success. And I showed him Little Wayne's and uh, Michael Jackson's. Michael Jackson has a really good one. It's very unique that this is mostly like an all black cast. It's coming to me where she's from. It's coming to me. <laughs> that's humor, right? <laughs> Come on, that's funny. Ha, 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 ha. 
There's a lot of handicap jokes in this. This is. That's weird. Horrible. I know a lot of people walked away with TVs and shit. Gonna shoot someone just because they were running away? Damn straight, give him more. Oh, are you kidding me? I'm blaming it the whole goddamn city. Wow. Yeah, now I want to know where that fucking shot came from. Oh! No, he's a cop, all right. That's right. Clear that image. That's right. I want to know who this guy is, too. Mm hmm. Pay a little visit to this guy. Mechanic or neurotransmitter system. Huh. Interesting. So I already knew he was Mantis. I just didn't want to say anything for anyone watching because from that top 10 video I saw, they, they, they already like it. Kind of just showed that he was Mantis. But how interesting. I want to know how can he stand though.
Oh, I get it. It's like a neural, a neural thingy thing thing. That's like the suit. Where did he get that kind of technology, though? So is it not alien technology? I was under an impression that it was alien technology. Hmm, this came on NBC. Get down. Whoa. Get down, fool. Damn. What, they got grenade launchers? I know that black actor. He's been in a lot of stuff. Like uh, The Wood. I'm thinking about reviewing that movie, actually. Damn. <laughs> I feel like this show is trying a little too hard to be cool, but it's it's it's, it's, it's alright. I mean, it's it's cool. It's cool. You know, they don't got to do all that. That's what Mantis wears. A suit and a tie and a jacket. Right in your ass. Huh? So I want to know if it's the suit that makes him deteriorating because you know that lady said that he's getting worse
It's like this guy was Black Panther before Black Panther. Nineties <laughs> technology. What an interesting show. What? Wait, you mean to tell me this guy is so rich he has like an underground water city? Like a water world? How the hell did he build that without people getting suspicious? This is interesting. I bet I can tell you why this show got canceled. Uh, and it had, had nothing to do with views. Guarantee you. It's a long ass episode. You gotta break it in two parts. Huh. <laughs> You want to destroy your own fucking hood for two hundred dollars? No, that man go to jail. Useless ass for two hundred dollars, bro. That shit is not worth it. shit
Oh, they got a black dude that know karate. <laughs> You're like, huh? Do mantis do that? Do they stung people? <laughs> yeah, I'm staying my ass down. <laughs> For real. Then why the hell did you bring them here? Hmm. He kind of didn't have a mask. You can kind of tell who he is. I kind of like that. That was a kind of a cold ass lion. Keep on learning. Ooh, that's kind of cool. How come I'm feeling a superhero? You paid 25 grand for that fucking tape. <gasps> no. Oh, I thought it was a car bomb. She about to pepper spray you, dog. Don't shake her hand. I don't trust this lady. Wow. He about to kidnap her?
His technology is crazy. So it's not even alien technology. It's like a, uh, I don't know. It's like it's like all neuro technology, you know, within the brain. Like super advanced stuff that he's created. Wow. Wow. How much time is left? Okay. You got some ribs. Oh my god! You lost your damn mind, brother. Damn. He better throw his ass off the roof or something. But who? No, oh, clearly that guy. Ha <laughs> ha. Politics. I'll never forget when I went to Japan. The things they do over there for politics, that's like the weirdest stuff. They get like vans, like just a bunch of vans, and they ride, like they drive across a city yelling at you to vote for them. <laughs> it's the craziest thing, and people like really listen to it. Just imagine that. Imagine walking across the street and you see like three vans coming at you, just yelling with microphones. So it's like, ah, vote for me. It's crazy, man. Wow. <gasps> <laughs> 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 
hands. <laughs> Why would he hide it there? <gasps> oh my god. You can't. Oh, I can't. I can't. <laughs> what a plot twist. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god. This black man crazy. There's nothing but corruption, man. You gonna do that to your own people? God damn. Oh, she's super uncomfortable. She up out of there. Wow, he was gonna kill him like that. Run. Take the damn hills off, girl. What are you doing with the payphone? No, you run. Oh, Lord. This black man crazy. How you gonna do that to a woman? Or to a human being. Because he was about to do that to the guy. This guy trying to shimmy his way to, to safety. <laughs> Curiosity killed the cat. Wow. I gotta show this to my, my, my family. I gotta show this to my brother. You lost your mind, brother. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I just... I kind of... I just thought about Mantis hanging from that ship. <laughs> he was just hanging. Oh my god, he about to throw her off. Oh my god. No! That's one hell of a pilot. God damn. No! Wow. How he get over there? But you we do not get too many all black superhero sci fi show. I even said to myself like a year ago, there's no such thing as like a black sci fi. Like black people are not in sci fi. Not really. Deep Space Nine, that's the only thing I can think of. Ah. 
How the hell did you miss? I like Mantis, but he gotta change his wardrobe. Come on, man. <sighs> what? You mean all that technology fucking waters would stop you? Whoa. Oh. He was a bitch. Damn. Damn. Damn, that's a crazy pilot. I'm not gonna lie, it started a little slow. It started a little slow. But it definitely picked the it picked up. And I'm liking it. Nah, I'm gonna find the rest of the series. This is kind of cool. I can totally see this as a comic book. I wonder if it is a comic book. I'm gonna check my comic book out. God, what a bitch. That's true. Damn, that's true too, man. It ain't worth selling out. This dude really doing the most to win this damn election. Okay. There's no Mantis comic book I checked.
Can you believe this guy? Wow. I can't believe this dude. Wow! Y'all really opening fire like that? In public? Well, you might wanna... Uh... I can't believe they shooting like that. Yeah, look, dude, these bullets are going somewhere, bro. the hell that shit is crazy Oh my god. I've been flying one of these things since. Oh shit. Oh. <laughs> Went out like an idiot. Oh, he's about to hang from the ship again. I can tell. I can feel it. Wow. <laughs> He's almost like Shaft. <laughs> He's like if Shaft was a superhero. Wow. And you were about to. My God. <gasps> oh, my God.
What do you mean they shot start? Literally everyone is paralyzed. <laughs> wow. Oh, boy, we've been caught up in a deep spy game. Damn. <laughs> oh. Well, I'm liking this show. I wonder what, when the show came out. I was 94, but... What month? Wow, August 26. Wow. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Hmm. Be realistic. It's called Wakanda. It don't exist. Ooh. Never stop learning. Mantis. He needs like a, a, a call or something. Him leaving like little mantis toys, that's kind of whack. <laughs> I'm glad he didn't continue to do that. Hmm. Hey, I like that. Searching for another world. Oh, that's a, that's the episode. Wow. All right, I like that. Hey. <laughs> I like that. Wow. Yeah, I like that. Hell yeah. It started off slow. I'm not gonna lie. It started off slow. Checking the time, even like 25 minutes in, you know, you're kind of like, uh, like, uh, all right, but nah, this is good. I like it. I like it. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna, I don't even know where you would even find the second episode. Holy crap, this shit is rare. I like it. I like it. Wow, that was pretty cool. I'm gonna go back and re listen to that. Oh, he says, wow, I really liked it. That was pretty cool. And then is, what else is cool, too, is like a bunch of like bunch of actors, bunch of actors, like is as if like really good actors just got together and like, let's just make something. 
make something cool. And shout out to Sam Raimi for, you know, creating something cool too. Wow. Yeah, I'm glad I watched this, man. That's pretty freaking cool, man. And and it's actually kind of sad now that I'm thinking about it because, you know, this is listed on that top 10 that I said uh, to you guys earlier that it is one of the most forgotten shows. Like, no one knows this show really exists, you know? And um, I didn't know. I didn't know it, it exists. Um, and it found me. So hopefully now I can, um, you know, share that experience with you guys and you guys go watch it. But yeah, I really liked it. I thought it was really cool. Um, I'm very interested in all the characters. And uh, I want to know more. I want to know more about what drives Mantis. You know, obviously we've seen the 1991 riots and him getting shot in the back with a sniper rifle. And you see it, that was like a little foreshadowing there. Um, because the guy who shot the, the mayor also did it with a sniper rifle. And it kind of seemed like he was in doing it from the same position too. Like, like you know, on one knee and shooting him. So, very interesting. Very, very interesting. I'm going to look up. I'm going to figure out where that lady's from. She's not even credited on this show. That's insane. Unless, she should be credited. I don't know why. I'll probably, I'll probably search again. But, unless she's, like, not on... Because sometimes pilots, they do that, you know? You shoot a pilot and... Uh, you shoot it, you shop it around. And sometimes it shops around for months maybe even on some occasions maybe even years and then they it finally gets picked up and then when it gets picked up certain actors are you know some can't do it um you know that happened to one of my favorite shows of all time my so-called life from 1995 i think the show came out in 95 but it was originally filmed in 93 i think and yeah, it just it just it just didn't get picked up until much later, and then they are like, "All right, let's bring the cast back." And then the, Angela Chase, the character Angela Chase, who was played by um, Claire Danes, was like thirteen when they filmed, and now she grew, and she's fifteen, and all the other characters, and it was just like, yeah, they're a lot older now, but it, it played on that show. But yeah, anyway, I love Mantis. Um, I loved, I loved this pilot. This pilot was really good. It was really good, and I just felt connected to it. Not only the the acting and the the story, but just the what, what I can relate to it. Just being a, a black man, and you know, there are certain times. Yeah, sure, it came off as cheesy, like you know, gang violence, the whole let's be friends. <laughs> stop killing each other let's be friends you know it, it, it can get a little cheesy but at the same time it's universal man it's pretty universal i think i think this show this pilot was at its best when it was trying to talk about the corruption of politics and and how that's trying to shape the city that they want to live in and not necessarily the, the city that the people want to live in so I thought that was really cool. I can't wait for the show to get into more neuroscience talk and like talking stuff. Um, yeah. Um, I also I did a um, releasing a podcast and I did a full movie review on um, the horror movie Chucky, nineteen eighty eight movie. And when I did that, I had a special guest on there, um, my friend Dylan. And she loves sci-fi. So I'm going to totally recommend this show to her. I think she'll really like it. But, um, but yeah, that's the show. Man, I can keep talking about this and keep showing, the like, keep bringing theories. Like, wow, man, what does the season have to offer? I'm going to show, I'm, oh, man, I'm totally going to um, send this to my friend Claudius. This is, uh, yeah, comic books are, like, up his alley. So, yeah. All right. Well, that's the review. That's the full episode review. I enjoyed Mantis. I'm probably going to watch it again tomorrow. This whole episode, this whole pilot again. I'm going to show my, my brother and his and his um, his girlfriend. Um, they're going to absolutely love it. I, at least I hope so. I think they'll I think they'll like it. This is this was a fun pilot. This is a fun show. This is totally fun. So, uh, all right, guys. That was the uh, full episode review. That was Mantis. The runtime is 
like an hour 25 minutes um yeah as a pilot i give it a i might give it a nine mm, well no it started off pretty slow i'll give it like an eight uh, like an 8.5 maybe i can round it up to a high eight it did start off slow so it's gonna get some points deducted for that but um yeah i really like it i really like it can't wait to see what you guys thought about it so um that is the review holy crap this is like an hour and 35 minutes of filming what that's crazy all right guys i will see you guys on the next one be on the lookout for more uh more content so until then victory or death starfighters <laughs>